students today let us discuss about mean so arithmetic mean is the average of the numbers it indicates central value of a set of numbers so in the today's lesson we will see how to calculate mean for ungrouped data and grouped data grouped data discrete type and continuous type Let us see the calculation of mean of ungrouped data. The formula for calculation is x bar is equal to sigma x by n. See an example. Calculate the mean of physiology marks of 5 students. Here marks of 5 students are given. So sigma x is 54 plus 62 plus 55 plus 70. That will come around 306. So n is the total number of sample. Here there are 5 in number. So mean x bar is 306 divided by 5. That is about 61.2. So here 61.2 is the mean of the physiology marks. Now mean of grouped data discrete series the formula is x bar is equal to sigma fx by sigma f x bar is a mean f is the frequency sigma f is the sum of all frequencies or you can say it is capital n x is a value of variable see this example calculate the mean of the following the marks have been given in the first column marks have been given in the first column and f is given in the second column so fx is fx you will get by multiplying f and x so in the first row 10 into 6 equal to 60 so like that we have calculated it for all the rows so sigma fx will come around how much 674 so the sigma's fx here is 674. Sigma f is 40. So 674 divided by 40, you will get 16.85. So here the mean is, here the mean is 16.85. Now mean of grouped data, continuous series. For continuous series, Mean is calculated by using the formula sigma f into m divided by sigma f. Here, sigma f is a total frequency, that is a capital N, sigma f dot m. m is the middle value of each of the data. Sigma f dot m is the sum of middle values multiplied by frequencies. So, let us see an example, then it will be clear to you. See this example. Calculate the mean of the following data. Here class intervals are given 1 to 10, 1 to 10, 3, 11 to 20, 11, 21 to 37, 31 to 44, 41 to 50, 50. The frequency and class interval are given. So how will you calculate the mean? Formula we have already discussed. Let us see how it is calculated. See, the first column, we have plotted down all the values. In the second val uh, column, we have found out the middle value of each of the class interval. Here, in the first row, you see 10 plus 1 divided by 2, you get 5.5. .5. And in the second row you get a 20 plus 11 divided by 2 15.5 like that you have to calculate the middle value the middle value is given here and in the third column in the third column the frequency is given and in the fourth column fm that you get by multiplying f and m so here in the first uh, row 
you got 5.5 into it is 5.5 into 3 that is 16.5 similarly you have calculated values for all the values and finally the sigma fm you got it as 1190 so sigma fm you got by adding all these numbers 16.5 plus 170.5 plus 178.5 plus 142 similarly for all you got it as f f sigma fm is equal to 1190 now you are going to calculate the mean the sigma fm by sigma f so 100 and 1190 divided by 40 so the answer here is the mean here is 29.75 by substituting those values in the formula you got the mean as 29.75 thank you please subscribe the channel for other calculations